Nose Figures. Welcome back to my secondary channel. Today we're going to be doing the NECA Series 9 Grid Alien from AVP, otherwise known as Alien vs. Predator. So here we are, and there's the figure. So let's take a look at the box. So here it is. Here's the Grid Alien, even though it's not re really the Grid Alien. So. So yeah, it says right here, Grid Alien, right there, and there's the air and drone, AVP, uh, AVP right there, on the back, here we have the bio, if you want to read it, nice art of Grid, grid Alien, AVP, you know, it was a predator, on the bottom we have the, um, I believe it was the um, Star Review here, Long Bang. They're my neighbors, or should I say, all the people in my neighborhood are shooting fireworks because I know it's. This is probably going to go up uh, today because it is Happy New Year. So, here's the Grid Alien right there that I have. I was hoping to get this one for this Christmas, but oh well. Because I had no interest of this one because I didn't really like it. I only like the regular one, but oh well. I think that's the prototype. Yeah, I think it's the prototype alien. Yeah, and there's the alien warrior right there, the regular version. Because these two are both the same, but slight, slightly different colors. So, so yeah, that is basically it for the box. And also, I do have two of the exact same figures. So let's put them up. So yeah, I got two of them for this Christmas. I was hoping for the Alien Warrior, but... Because I had no interest of the Great Alien, but oh well. Got them anyway, so might get them next time. Hopefully. So yeah, here's the other one. Put that to the side, so let's take a look at the figure. The figures are pretty cool. Figure, so... Oh, oh. Sorry if you hear... Adjusting. Come on. Ah, there you go. So here's the figure. So the figure has no accessories, but the figure has a nice paint job. It has nice the grid pattern. The reason why they call it because in the movie, Celtic shoot his net, and that's why why he has all these scars on the chest and the shoulders and the rest of the dome head, which is pretty cool. So let's go ahead and start. Yeah, mine, this head was pop. This head came off when I first got him, the head popped up. So basically, I had to carve so much of the plastic off to make the head stay on. And it does not like to stay on. So I might have to add hot water. And so hopefully, or I might try to um, add some super glue who on the ball joint and just hopefully add it on to the head and hopefully let's start up the the detail is very nice in the figure. The figure is a very cool figure. It has nice grid head net pattern going on and nice detail on the claws there, nice silver, nice silver on the teeth and we see the extended mouth. Come on. Almost got it. Ah. Come on. Oh, yeah. I think I need to add super glue to that ball joint. And then the, um. Oh, yeah, it's really stuck in there. Ah, got it. So, yeah, the secondary mouth has, has a black color with some silver teeth. But it kind of has. Yeah, it does have a little bit of detail in there on the mouth, which is pretty cool for the grid alien. To start off the articulation. The articulation. Oh my god, shut up, neighbors. Sorry, sisters. Because I understand it's New Year's, but I just want to get this review out. So, articulation it has a double jointed knee, and this one is pretty ah, stuck. I think I need to add some hot water into this knee. It has a double jointed knee, and Unfortunately, on my leg, it's a little stiff, so I think I might have to add a little bit of hot water. So yeah, double jointed on the knees, but if yours get... Ah, good lord, it's super tight. 
And if yours get tight, add some super, add some super hot steaming water to the internet, and the toes can move up and down, and feet are on a ball joint. They can move out and in, not all the way 360 though. Well, they kind of can. They can bend up. They can bend down. You can get in like a a uh, crowing bows and whoop the head. Yep, I definitely need to add and so super glue on that ball joint and add super glue in there. Hopefully, you can do that. Because the other one did not. So, it has a double jointed elbows and the finger claws do move. Well, you're basically getting a. Uh, oh my god. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. You know, I was just using the other one. So. Here's my second one. So let's just use this one. So the head is on a ball joint. It could look up. Down's limited, but down is not no because it has the big bulky the tubing going on. It does look up. Um about that far. Also the tail is on the bendy wire, so you basically can get into any pose. And you can basically get into the flaps right here. I like the flaps of the tail and this spike tail. But in the movie, um in the movie, it did not have, when Celtic, I think he cut off, like, this section of the tail, because I know NECA actually released the, a two-pack of both the Celtic Predator and this guy, except they used the Alien Warrior head to make the same grid pattern, what they did on this figure, and, and the figure has a up and down waist, twist right side, and I think for the other one, double jointed elbows and move at the fingers. Here's in the mouth does open up and the extended mouth does come out. If your extended mouth probably doesn't come out, use a pair of tweezers. And that's basically it for the figure. Now let me go ahead and go get a comparison real quick. Well actually I do have the a other alien warning. Let's focus. Go. So let's bend the head and down. So here it is next to the other alien warrior. Whoop. Yep, I definitely need to add super glue on that. I should have never carved it. But oh well. Yeah. Yeah, this head. Stay on, man. Stay on. There we go. And oh, it has it can move at the lay. Like some odd reason they move both, so I may have to hold down this. It does move forward about that much, backwards not that much, and in and out. So yeah, it does have hip articulation and already covered the chest. So for comparison here it is next to the Oh my god. The second one in majority stand up. Oh my god. Sorry guys, this, these figures are no one. Ah. Try to stand it up. Yeah, as you can see here the legs of mine are a little warped, so No, I think it might be the feet. Maybe it has. There we go. Got the other one to stand. And let's get this one to stand. Get this one to stand. Like. Whoop. Like so. So yeah, here are the two. So up here are the two side by side, both the same height, but however, actually, oops, I'll just leave this one out and go ahead and get my ancient warrior predator, which I am going to review next, so, there it is next to the ancient warrior predator, which I did get this Christmas, but 
mean, I like Temple Guard because I had no interest in that one as well. So I had no interest in these two, but oh well. Got him anyway, so here it is next to Ancient Warrior. As you see here, here the Great Alien is taller than it. So he's like towers over it. But I am going to review him next, don't worry. So, so yeah. Um, my interest with this alien... Well, okay. Yeah, kill that ancient warrior to so, Um, my interest with the grid alien... And make sure you get a good one. Make sure you find one that's a lot better. That has a head that's not come out of the box. That's like a part of the body. Make sure you... If your gets like stuck joints, just use steaming hot water, like I said. I recommend it. I do recommend this figure. But if you want the different alien, turn the back of the box real quick. Um, if you want the warrior warrior alien right there, you can. You can get it, which that's I'm thinking of getting. Hopefully, but because I like this better. There, then grid because I like grid alien. It's kind of like the um, it has a AVP color, but I heard this has a more of a lightish color than grid. So, so yeah, man, this thing does not want to stand. Stand, stand, man, stand. There we go. Sorry, it's just this figure. Likes to fight me standing. So. And then it's supposed to face down. There. So yeah, I hope you guys. So, which one do you like? Do you like the Alien Warrior or Grid Alien? Vote for these two in the comment section below. So, yeah, yeah, that is then the review of the AVP Grid Alien figure series nine. Alien Series 9, and I'll see you guys later, so keep collecting, keep reviewing, so take care, keep collecting, Ding. I'll see you guys later, peace.